Now we're doing Freight Code Camp, JavaScript Algorithms and Data Structures Beta. Learn basic JavaScript by building a role-playing game. Step 80. All right. So just like our locations array, our weapons array will hold objects. We're going to add four objects to the weapons array, each with two properties, name and power. The first should have the name set to stick with the power of five. And then the second should be dagger with 30. The third would should be claw hammer with 50. And the fourth is going to be sword with 100, right? So for this one, let's drop this uh, bracket down like that. And then let's have a set of curly braces. And then let's drop those down while we're at it. Pardon me, drop that uh, closing one down while we're at it. So we'll start off with name as our first key. And then we'll set it to the uh, string of stick. Stick like that. And then we'll have a comma. And we'll bring it down here and say power is now five, right? And I like to do these first, at least the first one, because it's easier to double click than trying to like aim between two uh, quotation marks. You know what I mean? So we'll come over here after this curly brace and we'll have the uh, comma. We'll come up, we'll bring it up to a, pardon me, we'll select from 23 up to the end of 19, copy it, then we'll paste it one, two, three times. All right, we'll say, take the second stick, call it dagger. The third stick we'll call claw hammer. And the fourth stick we'll call sword. All right, then we'll change this fourth power, this sword power to 100. We'll add a zero after the five on claw hammers. Then we'll change this one on dagger to 30 like that, right? And let's take care of this. Let's take out this uh, comma, this last comma, and that should be it. So let's check the code. Looks good. And submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 81. And we'll see you next time.